It says in Isaiah 33, verses 15 and 16, that he that walketh righteously and speaketh uprightly, he that despiseth the gain of oppressions, that shaketh his hands from holding of bribes, that stoppeth his ears from hearing of blood, and shutteth his eyes from seeing evil, he shall dwell on high. His place of defense shall be the munitions of rocks. Bread shall be given him. His waters shall be sure. For those students of prophecy watching this video, did you notice that last part? Most of us in the remnant church know what time it is, prophetically speaking. And no, we don't know the day or the hour of our Lord's return, but we do know the season. When the mark of the beast in Rome is enforced with the death penalty, and it comes time for us to run to the hills, caves, or forests to await the return of our Lord, we have been promised that our bread and waters shall be sure while we wait on our Lord. But if we are the kind of people that don't have honorable speech, don't walk righteously, the kind of people that love to speak in vulgar ways or even partake in gossip and fault-finding, or if we take advantage of those that the Lord sends our way, financially or even spiritually, if we are the type to take bribes for any reason, if we are the kind of people that enjoy watching or listening to stories of violence and murder, which is often the case in everything from popular novels to Hollywood movies. And yes, this also includes those very violent and bloody cage matches wherein some men actually die on camera. If we love to look upon these things as a form of entertainment, and this includes porn, violent video games, Hollywood movies, music videos, the list of evil things to look upon nowadays is literally off the chart. Many even fail to realize how evil something as simple as being entertained by fiction can be deadly to their soul. I mean, if you remove the blinders and realize fiction is nothing more than allowing Satan to lie to you in a way that entertains you. If we are the type of people that cannot do as the prophet Isaiah outlines, we will not be in that number, wherein our bread and waters shall be sure. So again, we know what time it is. Therefore, we need to prepare ye the way of the Lord. Make his paths straight. Thank you for watching. God bless.